Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I haven't done this in a while. This is, uh, is it easy? Is it fun? And it, this is the top recommended game to me on Google Play for this week. It is Sunday today, so it's, I'm guessing, the new week. And uh, no surprise, it's a word game. And it's asking me what language, so let's go ahead and choose English. Wow, we're going to turn the sound down on that. Sounded like uh, an explosion. English, okay. It won't let me click okay. There we go. It's just being slow. Your turn. Start. I don't know anything about the game. Um, I'm guessing I'm playing against those two players up at the top. Faithful Crow, then Professor Chris. The, na the game is called Chris, so let's go ahead and start. Okay, then. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Keep going, pro. <laughs> um, pro. I thought it was going to be product. Pim. Kelly. Word completed. I don't even know what word that's supposed to be. Short for California. Uh, o. E. Just putting letters randomly. R A N. Oops. I really have. I have four seconds left. I don't really know what I'm supposed to be doing. Um. So we got two letters, right? <laughs> I got two points. Um. Two points for ill. Kelly. Is this actually English? Uh, I don't see. Let's go ahead and see if there's an option. I don't want to leave the game. I want to figure out how to play the game. New mission. Professor Chris scored seven points. Um, let's see. Something that explains access now. I don't want to do that. Connect. Overview. It still doesn't tell me. Oh, I am Faithful Crow. Okay. That's interesting because I have a an ancestor, a recent ancestor whose last name was Crow. Uh I still don't know how to play. All right, let's go back and let's try a new game. See what happens. Practice, Chris. Random opponent. We're gonna do practice. All right. New game. No. Ha. Huh. Okay, so this is not. Oh, I have three days. Okay. So click on one of those. Your turn. Start. Still not sure what I'm doing. Nautical jet. Oh, wait. Okay, there's clues. Okay. If I had bothered to read the board before, I only have a minute to do this. Master language. There are no letters on the board. This is weird. Diminutive suffix. Vowel. Let's do a vowel. I'll put it there and then put it there. Um, branch out. English poet. I don't have enough letters to do any of this. What the heck? Branch out. Char. Yeah. Master A language. Derogatory suffix. Chlorine. I don't know, we're just going to put letters out. 
no idea what any of this means. I got one right for a vowel. This is really weird. I don't know if you can change. Um, derogatory Suffolk. Nato Suffolk. Angled Pipes. Pronoun. I'm supposed to be able to use these letters at the bottom. I don't, I don't understand. The fruit tree. No, no, we can't move once from before. Makeover, mental strain, knee, skirt denial, angled water pipes, water dams. I have no idea what I'm doing. Seven seconds. One of the problems is it doesn't tell you what the right answers were. So you don't know where to go. Alright, we're just going to drag some letters out. Derogatory suffix. Uh, angled pipes, the we're just putting letters out randomly. I'm just gonna end it. I don't know what I need in there. Points in round zero. Uh, if you understand what's going on, um, go ahead and tell me in the comments if you've played this before and this makes any sense to you whatsoever. Overview, last 10 games, 1, 0. Settings. Language, game rules. What is the game about? In Chris, you solve crossword puzzles with and against your friends. You can play online with Facebook friends. Game is turn-based. Neat to turn starts with the player being assigned fine. Five random letters until all letters are used. When it's your turn, you have one minute to place as many letters on as possible on the game board. Letters not placed correctly, you will keep it to the next round. Game board example. You can zoom in and out on the board by tapping on it. One point for every letter placed correctly. When a word is completed, you get one point per letter in the word. If you place a correct letter on a blue bonus field, total number of points in current turn will be doubled. Five points in bonus for placing all five letters correctly in one term. Power up. This is the reveal power up. This can be used to reveal any letter on the game board that only you will see. Overtime power up can be used to instantly add 40 seconds. This is the replace power up. Using the power up will allow you to select up to five letters and replace them with new ones. Once a player is taking their turn, the opponent will be notified their turn can start. While waiting for the opponent to take the turn, the game board is visible, but no longer than two minutes after your turn was completed. The turns will shift until the entire puzzle is completed. The player who has the highest score at this point wins. Have fun. Skipping turns. If there are less than ten letters left and you end your turn without placing any letters, your letters will be sent to your opponent. Okay, so I kind of understand. Okay. So that's a pomegranate going down to so now. You're simply the best. Um, I don't have spell pomegranate. Pro duct. Word completed. How is that word completed? Oh, 12. Okay. Me. 10. Um, 
product. Oop, I didn't actually do that, but vegetable. All right, now I get it. It only took me, what, how far me? 10 minutes to figure it out? Double up. Points in round. 34. My turn. I have one letter. That's a nose. Uh, close. Yeah, I, can, I can see what these words are, but I don't have any so spin or spiral going across. I don't have any of the letters I need. I need a U for the word across product, pomegranate, I need a G, rain, oh I have an I. Um, thumbs up would be okay. City in Brazil would be Rio. Arrows. Close. I just don't know what that is. USA. I don't have a U. So I'm pretty much stuck. Exits. Doors. Alright. Well, anyway. Let's see what we get. Try one more turn. get any of the letters I need to finish these doors arrows done um, don't, oh, I do have a K okay and that also makes that tree an oak um, not sure what that note uh, triple clef is supposed to be. Um, knee, I don't have an E. Four. Teach, educate. Spin, I do have the S. Rio, I still don't have. I don't have a G. Um, or, nope, yeah, just, oh, H for Hong Kong. Close, t-shirt, oh, dang it. Ran out of time. All right, well, that's the game. Now that I know how it's played, it is easy, um, kind of fun. But I didn't like the first five minutes where I had no idea how to play it. And there was no directions on how to find how to play it. So thumbs down for that. But overall, the game itself is fun. And I'd probably play it again. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments. Well, let's just go ahead and finish. You know what? Let's just go ahead and finish this game. T-shirt. T-shirt. Rio. Educate and that just finishes the board. So I don't stops ends. Pull his toe. So yeah, this is kind of cute. Now that I know how to play it, but really really wouldn't give it that many uh, um, accolades for how hard it was to figure out what the heck was going on all right as i said earlier let me know what you think in the comments and uh 
And we will talk again. Thanks for stopping by. Bye.